Yeah, excellent. <laughs> Very good. CT CT2 GQN K1 KW. Well, you're doing a great job here, and it's all the conditions, too. Without this good ionospheric propagation, why we wouldn't have any of this. Uh, good conditions here on uh, 10 today. Thank you for the contact, and uh, seven threes. CT2 GQN, this is K1KW signing. This is a Kilo One Kilo Whiskey near Boston, Massachusetts, uh, QRZ. Yeah, it was a G3, I'm not sure I got the call right, G3 Delta Golf Whiskey, is that uh, correct? Uh, K1KW, go ahead. Yeah, very good, David. Yeah, darn good whiskey. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> G3DGW, K1KW. K1 uh, <clears throat> Killer Whiskey. I don't know. <laughs> I just, very good. Well, nice signal from you. You're 5 and 8 to 9 on the meter here. S8 to S9. Good signal near, I'm in the town of Bolton. Lancashire, but uh, we're out here 30 miles west of Boston. Running uh, some commercial and homemade stuff here. Most of it's uh, highly modified uh, amateur gear out of the 50s. Johnson Viking Ranger 2 with external audio and processing, a Collin 75A4, homemade amplifier, and homemade uh, 36 element antenna system here, uh, David. Anyway, back to you. Quite a few folks uh, calling in there. It's good to hear. Uh, all sorts of AM activity here today on 10. G3 DGW, K1, KW, over. Yeah, very good. D G3 uh, DGW, this is uh, K1, KW. Yeah, well, yeah, I was an AM back in the 60s as well and built a lot of homebrew uh, transmitters. Oh, boy, all sorts of stuff. Uh, probably went through the entire iMac tube book. I built a transmitter with... Probably one of each of the iMac tubes at least once or twice. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, then I, I got off of AM for a while. Uh, but I've always had an interest. I've made a few friends over the years on, on that mode back when I was in high school in the 1960s and uh, maintained, uh, you know, those friends over the years and still keep in contact on AM on 75 meters and 40. But this uh, AM on the 10 is, uh, is interesting. I, I've been doing this for a few years. Uh, but uh, I'm amazed at the, the continued interest. And certainly the AM is capable of good fidelity and quality, and that's one of the reasons I, uh, I enjoy it. Anyway, with that, uh, take care. Um, David, thanks for coming back to the call there. Uh, G3DGW, K1KW. Yeah, very good, uh, David. Pleasure to make your acquaintance here. Best of seasons, uh, greetings to you. Thanks for coming back. Appreciate it. And a uh, nice signal from you as well here on uh, 10. D3, G3. <laughs> this is K1KW saying 73s and uh, K1KW, Kilo 1, Kilo Whiskey, uh, QRZ. Okay, I got a mobile station in there. The Baker X-Ray Mic. My pencil go. Oh, here it is. Baker X-ray Mike Mobile. Uh, go ahead. K1KW over. Oh, very good, Roger. Well, that's a nice mobile signal uh, <clears throat> from the UK. Uh, G4BXM uh, Mobile. K1KW. Very strong. Here, you're peaking S7 to 9. That's a nice signal uh, from the mobile. Uh, years ago, I did a little 10-meter mobile with a converted uh, uh, CB transmitter running 4 watts, and it was... Uh, when the conditions were just right, I, I could just uh, talk just about anywhere in the world, including Australia, Japan, uh, in the evening, uh, coming home from work with that uh, four, watts, uh, four watts of uh, converted CB radio. <laughs> it was amazing. Anyway, you're doing a great job. appreciate the call. My name is Chuck, C-H-U-C-K, and we're just outside of Boston in the town of Bolton. And it sounds like you get the rest of the particulars there from probably my descriptions uh, earlier. Uh, G4BXM.